how to read a file into a variable on host with Ansible, I'm going to show you a live demo with some simple Ansible code. I'm Luca Burton and welcome to today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Let's deep dive into the Ansible Lookup plugin file. Plugins are a way to expand the Ansible functionality. With Lookup plugins, specifically, you can load variable or templates with information from external sources. The full name is ansible.builtin.file, so it's part of Ansible core and is included in all Ansible installation. The purpose of the file plugin is to read the file contents. So exactly what we want. Parameters. The parameter of plugin file. The only parameter is the default terms with the path of file to read. The normal user is to assign the lookup plugin to a variable name, but you can use also in a task or your Ansible playbook. Demo time. Let's, let me show you one practical demo about how to read a file into a variable on host with Ansible playbook. Let's have fun. Welcome to my editor. First of all, let's suppose we have a text file named example.txt with some example content on it. We would like to read this file with our example playbook. So let me start typing. First of all, it's a YAML document, so let's start with free dash and then name read the file on host. This is the name of a play that is going to target host all of my inventory and let me define one variable contents that is going to contain the file content and let me specify that the value will be the lookup plugin. Okay, let me specify the name file. Here we go and this plugin need uh, a parameter, the file name, in my case example.txt because uh, it's in the same directory so I can use relative path. On the task list now I can use this new variable in the most conventional way. So the easiest way to print it out the content is to define task print file and use ansible.builtin.debug. With a parameter msg I can for example print it out on screen so the content of file is and let me use the variable like a normal variable the value of contents here we go as you can see I could uh, read a file on the Ansible host or controller very easy and assign to one variable name and this variable can be used in all the tasks like a normal variable no task will uh, understand if this is a, a value created uh, dynamically in another task or uh, a static value that we assigned in the variable list or read dynamically from a file. This is a very useful tool that you need to have in your toolbox. So let me switch to terminal to show you the execution. Welcome to my terminal. First of all, let me display the content of my example.txt file. In this case, it is uh, under the variable directory, so the same directory of my Ansible playbook. And now, let me execute the code. Ansible-playbook command, let me specify also the inventory file under virtual machine demo inventory. And of course, 
the playbook file and the variable I have uh, read file uh, YML. Here we go. The execution is going to be super fast because there is nothing to process uh, on the target machine. Only display the content of file. As you can see, example context is in the print file task. This is very convenient way for reading file uh, and maybe populate some data inside your Ansible playbook. And uh, if you execute again, what happened? Nothing is even potent the, the Ansible playbook. So I hope you like this content and uh, you can use it with a relative path like this or maybe some uh, absolute path because you can specify the full file system path. Now you know how to read a file into a variable on host with Ansible. Thank you for watching, if you enjoyed this video give me a thumbs up, write me a comment and in general keep in touch with me. See us on the next IT adventure of Ansible Pilot and have a fun reading file with uh, Ansible Lookup plugin, yay! This video is part of our Ansible automation program, sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun!